First of all, guys, good to have you here. Like, you know, we, we did the previous Grammys, you performed it all the way from Korea, but now you're here in person, everyone's healthy. How are you all feeling? How are you feeling? I feel good. I feel great. I feel crazy. It's great, man. It's great to have you here. Like, there are so many rumors I hear about you guys that I, I don't know what's true. I don't know what's... Did you, did you really learn how to speak English from watching Friends? Yes, Friends is my English parents. <laughs> so, so wait, wait, are you like more of a Joey? Who do you think you are? No, I'm like a, I'm a, I'm like a Chandler. Okay. I mean, I mean he's a, he's a, when I, when I see him, I was like, I feel so sad and, you know. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. I love him. I love his time. I like that. You, I heard that and I was like, I need to learn Korean then watching Korean TV shows. And I was like, it's, it's, it's a lot harder. But I, but I learned a little bit. And I, was, I was like, I'll practice um, just a little thing I learned, which was, uh, okay. Will that help me in an airport? Will that, will that get me around? Okay, so what are we gonna do? We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out, we'll figure it out. Okay. I feel like I got something wrong. All right, ladies and gentlemen, one of the most acclaimed recordings of the year is Tony Bennett and Lady Gaga's already Grammy award-winning duet, Love For Sale. Which, by the way, I've seen Love For Sale signs all over Las Vegas, but I'm not sure that was about the album. Tony Bennett retired from performing last year. He is a legend, and what he wanted to do is introduce his very dear friend.